Democratic presidential frontrunner Joe Biden is out with a stark warning for his opponents ahead of next week's debates. He says this, if you come at me this time, I am ready to hit back. His threat comes amid yet another fight centered around race between the former vice president and Senators Kamala Harris and Cory Booker. Ed O'Keefe is in Washington with more on this story. Boy, Ed, getting feisty already. So where already. is this already? Where is this new Biden stance coming from, do you think? Well, Gail, it's coming from an understanding that Democrats are looking most especially for the candidate they believe is best equipped to defeat the president. And doing so likely requires a strong debate to performance. So Biden knows he's got to step up his game at next week's debate. Wall Street did not build this country. Middle class people and access to the middle class build it. Former Vice President Joe Biden and other Democrats appeared this week at conferences hosted by civil rights organizations touting their plans to revamp the criminal justice system. But Biden also took time to defend his record on civil rights, in part by referencing President Obama. They did a significant background check on me for months with 10 people. I think my, I doubt whether he would have picked me if this accusations about my being wrong on civil rights was correct. Biden's lead over the Democratic field has slipped since the first debates. Do you agree today that you were wrong to oppose busing in America? This week, Biden was asked about a CBS News poll that identified California Senator Kamala Harris as the most strong candidate among Democratic voters. I was probably overly polite. In a radio interview Thursday, he also raised questions about Harris's motives at the first debate. I thought we were friends, I and mean, we, I hope we still will be. You know, she asked me to go to her convention and be the guy from outside of California to nominate her at her convention for the Senate seat. I did. Biden, Harris, and New Jersey Senator Cory Booker will be front and center at a debate next Wednesday. Booker is raising doubts about Biden's new plan to revamp federal sentencing laws and drug policy, since the former Veep backed tough-on-crime bills in the 1990s. For a guy who helped to be an architect of mass incarceration, this is an inadequate uh, solution. But Biden hit back, raising questions about Booker's past record as mayor of Newark, New Jersey. His police department was stopping and frisking people, mostly African-American men. If he wants to go back and talk about records, I'm happy to do that. But I'd rather talk about the future. Part of what Booker and Harris are doing is trying to build their support among black voters. But our CBS News Battleground Tracker poll out this week gives Biden a double-digit lead over his rivals, for example, in the early primary state of South Carolina, driven in part by deep support for him among black voters. Mm. Tony? All right, Ed, thank you very much.